project's going to be about testing covered center phase and putting lens across it to measure whether or not that's going to create a fault. So this project we're doing today builds on some research that PGE was involved in a number of years ago to look at a construction alternative to preventing outages caused by dug fur limbs that blow out during the wind, a wind and come across our power lines causing an outage. Rather than cover all three phases with a coated wire or a tree wire, we're looking today at whether or not covering just the center phase would accomplish the same thing and prevent those broken limbs from causing outages. So the first test we did involved a dug fir limb uh, about the same size that we would expect to see uh, every time there's a wind event that comes through our service territory of 35 to 40, 45 miles an hour. We laid that limb across two phases, one of which was covered, the other of which was still bare. We found that there was no effect. The system didn't see it, the limb just sat there, didn't cause a problem. Now that's significant because uh, we found that 70% of all of our tree-related outages are related to dug fir limbs or limbs breaking out and coming across phases like that. So we see this as a significant improvement uh, in reducing some of those limb-caused outages that occur every time the limb blows. We also wanted to see what would happen if we put a limb across all three phases with the center phase being covered. Our hope there was that we decreased the amount of voltage between the two bare conductors that the limb wouldn't uh, cause an outage. What we found is while it took a significant amount of time, it was almost 18 minutes before the limb faulted. What we learned from that was putting the center phase in the pull top position, it actually took quite a bit longer for that uh, fault to occur than it did if the center phase was on the arm. I think the other significant thing that we learned there is it's really difficult for us to get the limb to actually touch all three phases when the center phase is in the pull top position. So the whole idea today was to look at what's a cost-effective yet effective construction alternative that helps reduce tree-caused outages.